Remember the high school dramas that stayed etched in your memory. Square Pegs, the 1982 TV series, was one such gem that struck a chord with many. This show brought humor and authenticity to the teenage experience, following the trials and tribulations of two socially awkward girls navigating the complexities of high school. While the series only aired for a short time, its impact was lasting. Its relatable portrayal of adolescence left many viewers with cherished memories. Perhaps you recall a specific character who resonated with you, or maybe there's a moment from the show that still brings a smile to your face. Which role stood out as your favorite amidst the ensemble cast? We'd love to hear your stories and experiences related to this iconic series. Share your most cherished memory or a personal connection you have with Square Pegs in the comments below. Your tales could mirror those of others or provide a unique perspective that adds depth to the show's legacy. Ready to dive back into the nostalgia of high school hallways and teenage antics? Let's reminisce together. The TV series Square Pegs, created by Ann Beats, a former Saturday Night Live writer, drew inspiration from her personal experiences. The show, though short-lived, had an impact. When it got axed in 1983, CBS planned to air another teen comedy called The Best of Times. However, after a single episode, it also got shelved due to a lukewarm response. Filmed at the deserted Excelsior High School in Norwalk, California, the same spot where Grease 2 was shot, the cast faced challenges. The school was in an industrial area, making outdoor shoots less than pleasant because of the surrounding factory's strong odor. The blend of personal experience in the show's creation and its short-lived presence on television marks Square Peg's significance in TV history, despite its brevity. John Femia's journey in the entertainment industry took an unforeseen twist when the casting dynamics for the iconic show underwent an intriguing transformation. Initially slated for a distinct role, fate swiftly intervened, redirecting Femia's talents toward a new path, ultimately shaping the persona of Marshall Bletchman. His spur-of-the-moment proposal to reshape Bletchman into a comedic centerpiece became a turning point, rescuing his involvement in the series. The show's creator's openness to adaptation became instrumental, culminating in a portrayal that resonated profoundly with audiences, highlighting the fluidity crucial in the realm of television production. This unforeseen shift not only elevated Femia's performance, but also underscored the invaluable synergy between creative vision and flexibility in the entertainment industry. This unexpected narrative turn stands as a testament to the unpredictable yet captivating nature of show business, where innovation and spontaneity often converge to create memorable moments etched into the fabric of entertainment history. This intriguing episode in Femia's career illustrates the artistry and adaptability required to carve a lasting impact in the ever-evolving world of television, marking a milestone that continues to inspire aspiring talents worldwide. Tracy Nelson and Claudette Wells formed a lasting friendship on the set of this 80 Seconds TV gem. Meeting during the production of Square Pegs, their camaraderie blossomed into a lifelong bond that endures to this day. The enduring connection between Nelson and Wells showcases the off-screen relationships forged amid the challenges of creating the series. Beyond the scripted narratives, real-life friendships like theirs contribute to the enduring legacy of Square Pegs, proving that the impact of this brief but impactful show extends well beyond the screen. The bonds formed during those days on set continue to resonate, reminding us that sometimes the most significant stories are the ones written behind the scenes. Amy Linka, known for her role as Lauren Hutchinson in the 1982 TV series Square Pegs, underwent an intriguing transformation for her character. Initially considered too pretty for the part, she had to don fake braces and a fat suit. Linka revealed in an interview with E! Television that these alterations were necessary to fit the envisioned persona of Hutchinson. This unique approach to portraying a high school misfit sheds light on the efforts invested in shaping characters and the lengths taken to authentically represent them on screen. Linker's adaptation to embody the role beyond her initial appearance showcases the commitment to authenticity and character portrayal within the series, adding depth to the dynamics of the show's cast and characters. The show's cancellation surprised many, given its positive reception from critics and viewers alike. What wasn't initially apparent was the reason behind its abrupt end after just one season, 
Reports surfaced, revealing rampant drug use among both cast and crew during production. This revelation shed light on the darker underbelly of the otherwise acclaimed series, casting a shadow on its brief but impactful presence on television. The cancellation left fans and industry insiders stunned, redefining the narrative surrounding the show's legacy. Aidan Quinn auditioned for Johnny Slash in the 82nd series Square Pegs, but was considered too old for the role, which eventually went to Merritt Putrick. Interestingly, the show's creator, Anne Beats, maintained a lasting friendship with Amy Linker post-series. Even in 2020, they remained in touch. This iconic show, despite its brief run, left a mark on both its cast and creators, showcasing the enduring connections forged during its production. Aidan Quinn's audition tale and Beats' ongoing bond with Linker offer glimpses into the behind-the-scenes dynamics that contributed to the show's unique legacy. Behind closed curtains, the tragic toll of secrecy on Square Peg's cast member in the golden era of Hollywood. Amid the vibrant facade of the golden era of Hollywood, hidden behind the laughter and success of Square Peg's, lay the silent struggles of one cast member. Veiled beneath the spotlight, one member bore the weight of a harrowing personal battle. Despite the on-screen camaraderie, a haunting shroud of secrecy enshrouded their life. Away from the camera's glare, a silent struggle unfolded. The resonating laughter and camaraderie on set belied the internal turmoil plaguing this actor. Within the hallowed halls of fame, a veil of secrecy masked the personal tribulations they faced, a tragic narrative obscured by the glitz of Hollywood's glamour. The harrowing toll of this silent battle would eventually alter the trajectory of their Hollywood journey, marking an unexpected and poignant departure from the industry, leaving behind a poignant legacy eclipsed by shadows. This untold tale of this cast member resonates as a poignant reminder of the profound toll secrecy can exact in the world of entertainment. A narrative etched in the poignant silence of unspoken struggles, ultimately altering the trajectory of a Hollywood legacy. As we draw the curtains on this journey down memory lane, I'd love to extend an invitation for you to immerse yourself in nostalgia and reminisce about the unique charms of that 80 seconds TV gem we've been exploring. Your personal connection to that era might be wrapped in the witty dialogues, the quirky characters, or perhaps it's the timeless themes that struck a chord with you. I encourage you to share your treasured memories, those anecdotes that still bring a smile to your face, or those profound reflections that square pegs evoked within you. Your voice adds depth and richness to this shared experience, turning it into a collective tapestry of fond recollections. Thank you for lending your time and curiosity to this wonderful stroll through the corridors of nostalgia. Your insights and stories truly enrich the fabric of this shared journey. So keep those memories alive and let's continue celebrating the magic of square pegs together.